Hello, my name is Paul Yoder, field agronomist for Pioneer. Today I want to take a brief moment and share with you a plantability app that you may or may not know even exists that Pioneer has put together for you, the purchaser of Pioneer Sea Corn. Basically, in a nutshell, what it is is we have a building in Johnson, Iowa, in which we will bring through every batch of corn that we're selling. And every batch of corn will run through multiple planters that are out there in the industry. And we will provide you a quick summary of what is the best settings for your individual planter for your farm when planting Pioneer corn. So let me show you what this app looks like and exactly what it does. So once you've downloaded the app, basically all you need to do is just go and click on it. And once it comes up, it's going to allow you to pick your planter make. So just hit the drop down box here. As you can see, there's a multitude of different planters. Almost every planter on the market today, we have tested every batch of Pioneer Sea Corn that goes out our door to give you the best um, indicator of what plates, pressure, and so forth to use. So for this example, I'm gonna use the JD Vacuum. So I've selected that. And then I've already got uh, two tags. Uh, one is our new 1181 AM and then new Chrome technology. If you're not familiar with Chrome, make sure you talk with your seed agents about that. It's truly revolutionary when it comes to the overall trait and I think that you'll find that the yields with this new Chrome technology is going to be even better. So I'm going to look at this and I'm going to take, um, basically I'm going to go here and hit the scan bar and it's going to give me a picture. I'm going to come down here put my camera over the bar. I'm going to start with 1181. It's pulled in the batch number automatically. I'm going to hit submit and as you can see it's giving me the batch number, the hybrid, and then what grade size, kernel size it is, what plate disc is recommended, the pressure vac, the RPMs, and if you have a singulator brush what size to get of that. So again, this is something that is hopefully you'll find of use. Now, say we're switching hybrids and we're going to go with the 1055Q. Again, I'll hit this barcode. I'll put my camera over that barcode. You can see that it come, came up. I'm going to hit submit. It's giving me the hybrid, the product is 1055Q, the kernel size, and again, the, the plate disc the pressure vac, the RPM, and a singulator brush as to what's recommended that's going to give you the best plantability for a JD vacuum planter for that particular hybrid and that particular batch. Again, I hope that you found this video to be of use and good information for your farm and please feel free to call your Pioneer sales professional if you have any additional questions. Thank you and have a wonderful day. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.